Everyone, this is Samantha. Now, two days ago, Samantha gave birth to a beautiful baby boy, Michael. In fact, she named Michael after the man, her ex-boyfriend, Michael. Now, it should have been the happiest day of her life, but it wasn't. You see, because Mike told Samantha he doesn't believe the baby is his. Now, Samantha has sworn to, to Mike that he is the dad. She has told him in no uncertain terms he is the father. There's no other possible father. But Samantha now has had a change of heart and is ready to reveal a secret that she's been hiding from Mike. Watch. My name is Samantha. I gave birth to a beautiful baby boy named days ago named Michael. And then after my ex woman hopes that this would be his child, I once took care of a child for six years. And we got a DNA test that showed he was not the father and he was devastated. Now I have to come clean and tell him a secret that I have been hiding from him. I don't hold away any longer. It's time to tell the truth. Now you have a secret. He doesn't know you have a secret. No. All right, it has two parts. Two what's parts. The, what's the first part? Obviously, I have slept with somebody else. That he doesn't know about? No. And what's the second part? I have no idea who it is. I don't remember his name. Oh, it was just a stranger. <laughs> Who's the father of the child? It's either him or that one person that I was with um, the night. Um, you cheated on him. Yeah. You tried to convince him that he was the father, didn't you? I swear to him. We're going to find out the result of the test, but this is what Michael had to say. Watch this. I'm here today because I don't believe that I'm the father of Samantha's baby. Samantha's done everything she can to convince me that the baby's mine and the baby after me, but I'm not going to be for sure until I find out what the results are. In the past, I was a little girl until she was six years old, only to find out that she wasn't my child after doing a test. So I gotta make sure the child's mine. Samantha swears she hasn't had sex with any other man, but she's lied to so many times in the past, how can I believe her now? I'm kind of afraid to bond with the child, because I don't want to get attached to him if he's not mine. I know she wants me, but I hope she's not using the girls that he gives me back. Did you hear that? He's been deceived in the past. He raised a child for six years, then found out he was the father. Here's Mike. Welcome, Mike. Please. Mike, you heard Samantha's story. She said that she, your father, you have doubts there, right? Yeah. And, and also the history that you have led in terms of raising a child. Yes. Yeah. How hard was that to find out after Sigurds? That's very difficult, especially since I couldn't see her no more after that. I want to tell you, before we go any further, Samantha has to confess to you a secret. It may not be yours. I have suppose I had to sleep with somebody else. Oh. I was at a bar, um, drank one night stand, and then from there, that was it. So in other words, Mike, if you're not the father, then she has no clue. Let me ask this. If this is your child, you'll raise that child, wouldn't you? Yes. If it's your child, would you get back together? Um, that would be determined in the future between me and her because of the trust issues. But if you are the other, you're going to step up. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Let's find out. When it comes to 10-day-old Michael, Mike, you are the f <laughs> Samantha? You caught a big break for Samantha. Because you didn't know who the father of child is. I'm sorry I have to do it like this and you can now I'm with my voice but I want to see this is about my When Shia was 15, she got 